I'm here today with Inga Tulane, Chairman, President, and CEO of 3M. Wonderful to see you again. Thank you for giving Catalyst the opportunity to spotlight the progress that 3M has made for diversity and inclusion in your company. Thank you very much for being here. We were honored to recognize you with the 2017 Catalyst Award. I think it was a broad-based, incredible proudness in 3M when that moment was announced. And I think people felt very, very proud of the progress we have made. And still, we have more to do, and we will do more. We are a global company, so by definition, the foundation is very strong for us in terms of diversity. How do you move forward with an agenda around diversity and inclusion across those many different cultures? Mm -hmm. Well, I think, first of all, you need to make this a commitment as a leadership initiative. So you yourself need to lead by example, number one. Um, you need also to make sure that you constantly challenge your whole group and whole team and organization to focus on it. And also challenge your organization the whole time to see, okay, is there more we can do? Why can we not do it, etc. But I think it also starts with an explanation of it is a competitive advantage. That's actually the business case to do it. And, and people buy into competitiveness. They buy into it when they can see an outcome that is positive. Inclusion and diversity are core values for 3M and for me, together with sustainability. But you have to make sure in that shift that you really make sure that you're actually driving for competitiveness. That's the most important thing. As a leader, how do you live those values and commitment to inclusion? Well, I mentor people, I sponsor people, uh, I make sure that I have a, a group around me that are diverse. So in the internal group of six, there's three women and, and three men, and the two I, I mentor outside is one man and, and one woman. So that's one of the way for me to make sure that I send a very clear message and add in this initiative. What advice would you have for other CEOs who are looking to increase diversity and inclusion in their companies based on your experience? I think first of all, to make a personal commitment, you have to show it. People look upon what you do, not only what you say. So develop your business case for why this is important for you, uh, and then live it. You yourself must live it day out and day in, so people see that you are committed, that you drive it yourself, and that you challenge the organizations. We have more than doubled our market cap the last five years. Uh, there's a reason for that. There's many reasons for that. One is the inclusion and diversity. It's not the only one, but it's one portion of it. Well, it's interesting because Catalyst research shows that when there's more inclusion in a workplace, that innovation and team citizenship increases, how people work together, their willingness to create new ideas. And for a company like yours, where innovation is so important, um, it's interesting to see that link between the performance and what you've seen over time. Mm -hmm. Of course. I mean, for me, that's a given. For me, that's a given that you, you together will create better ideas, different ideas, and move forward. And, and 3M is not only of doing things better is to do things differently. And if you can get more brains, more background, more initiatives into a discussion, you would do things different, not only better. So for me, as, as you're saying, you know, we, we are global in nature. We have a very global workforce around the world, but we also need to make sure that every entity we have are becoming more diverse and more inclusive as we move ahead. Inga, thank you for being a champion for change, for sharing 3M's story with us and being a role model for other leaders. It's been a pleasure speaking with you today. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs>